Stratus clouds don't get a lot of attention, maybe because they are flat and gray and often come along with quiet weather conditions. It might also be because they block the sun, dulling the landscape, muting the colors, and maybe muting your mood. Stratus clouds are a part of the water cycle and they are found around the planet in all seasons. Stratus clouds are stratified, meaning they are generally the same from side to side with soft edges. They are wider than they are tall. Stratus clouds come mainly in three different heights of low, middle, and high. Regular stratus clouds are the lowest ones. As a blanket of gray clouds, they may be a mile above the ground, but usually they are lower than that. Stratus clouds can be low enough to blend with fog. Fog sits on the ground or on water. Stratus clouds may totally or mostly block the sun. When they are thick enough, they can create precipitation. Alto stratus clouds are middle level clouds. They are sheets or layers that could allow you to see the outline of the sun, but not to the point that the sun creates shadows. Precipitation might fall from these, but it might also evaporate before reaching the ground. Alto stratus clouds could be made of water droplets or ice crystals, depending on how cold the clouds are. These can be anywhere from a mile to three miles above the ground. Cirrostratus clouds are the highest and thinnest type of stratus cloud. Sometimes they are a silky veil and other times you can barely see them. You usually find them above three miles high. They will dim the sun or moon, but never totally block them so that you will usually see your shadow in the daytime. Since cirrostratus clouds are high, where the air is very cold, they are usually made of ice crystals that can bend light to create a ring or halo around the sun or moon. Cirrostratus clouds might be so thin that you wouldn't notice them without seeing the halo. Stratus clouds that create precipitation are known as nimbostratus. Stratus clouds that are also mixed with cumulus clouds are called stratocumulus. These are thick bands or groups which might have rows or gaps in between. Stratocumulus clouds are often about a mile above the ground. They may look like a blanket or quilt of rounded clouds that are shades of gray. Many different types of stratus clouds are also found together in layers, making it very hard to tell them apart. I'm meteorologist Alan Seals.